Hello, hello, hello! OMG! Welcome back to my channel. So excited that you are here. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. I appreciate you. It's Jody Dunn coming at you with round two of CBS because OMG, there are so many great deals this week per normal. If you're new and you just found the channel, so happy that you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know that you are new right down there. I would love to welcome you and say hello back to you. And if you are already subscribed, I appreciate you so much. Thank you for coming back to another video. I had to stop at the gas station and get gas and realized I forgot to film the intro. So I'm doing it here in the parking lot uh, because I'm running a little bit low on time just because this is a big massive haul today. And I did want to give you a quick update. Um, so we're going to be grabbing well over $200 in product today. Oh my gosh. I don't know if it's going to be a freebie, but we're going to get it to a super low cost, if not free. Um, so I'm so excited. Thank you all so, so much for all of your prayers. Oh my gosh, you guys are absolutely incredible. EJ is finally going home today. It was really a big, uh, um, so I told you already, the doctor three times, hospital, this was the second time. Her doctor called a doctor he knew and said, hey, please get this done. Um, they literally told Grayson in ER, the ER doctor did, we would not have run these tests if your doctor did not insist. And that's so frustrating. Listen, first of all, thank you to all of our hospital workers, especially the nurses. We need you, we appreciate you. If you are a mama or a grandmama, then you feel my frustration when you know there's something wrong with your child and they tell you it's the flu. Like they just dismiss you and they send you home and then you end up back again. Um, so anyways, they did run blood work on him, thank goodness, and they did some swabs and things. So he has para-influenza virus, which is not the flu, I had to Google it. Apparently it's fairly common. It can turn into a common cold. It can turn into pneumonia. Like it manifests itself in a lot of ways. I'm not a medical professional, so just Google it if you don't know what it is either. But the real thing was his white blood cell count was super duper. I'm talking way too low, which they never would have found out if they would not have run blood work. He is now feeling better. He is not running a fever. The white blood cell count is coming back up, but they're going to be doing some additional testing to find out if he does have something that is hereditary on his dad's side of the family. <sighs> Hopefully he does not. Um, but so happy that we have some answers and they are feeling better and they are coming home today. I think they're on their way home right now, actually. So I'm so happy. But that means I can't kiss my EJ anymore for a little while until they get the test run to figure out. Because <laughs> obviously if you have a white, a low white blood cell count, it makes it really hard to fight off any type of sickness, even a common cold. So anyways, again, just wanted to give you an update and thank you all so much for your prayers. All right, we're going to hunt into CVS. It's probably going to be a super long video because I'm grabbing a lot of stuff today. And I'm so excited. If you enjoy the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's run into CVS. All right, here we are for round two of CVS. We're going to start off with a little food deal. I'm looking for the three for eight candy. Uh, I want to grab some of the 100 grand bars because I love them. Couldn't find them. They're on an end display. So I found three of them. So these are going to cost me $8. I have the $2 off three instant CRT from last week and the $2 off three instant CRT from this week. And we just got coupons for $2 off and these are included. It's going to drop me down to $2 for all three bags. And I also have a $5 off when I spend $25 on food items. So I'm going to grab some more things to be able to use that. So my girls are running low on the Oreos, which they love the Oreos. So I'm just trying to figure out which ones I want to get. But they are on sale this week, two for $7. And they are on promotion for if you buy two, you earn back a $2 extra buck. 
That's like a coffee flavor. I didn't even know Oreo made that. I'm going to go ahead and grab a regular Oreos. My girls will be so happy. And I happen to love the golden Oreos way more than the chocolate Oreos. So I'm going to grab myself a box of the golden Oreos as well. And don't forget, always check your expiration dates on food. And I don't have any coupons for the Oreos. Uh, so the next thing I'm going to grab, they've got select uh, Kellogg cereal on sale for $1.99 this week. I'm going to grab two boxes of the Frosted Flakes. And we're going to get a little double dip action on the Frosted Flakes. So I'm going to go ahead and use a printable coupon. I printed it right through my Swagbucks link so I get paid to print and paid to redeem for $1 off of two. And then I also have a digital coupon for $1 off of two that will double dip and come off. And then the last thing I'm gonna add to this little food scenario is the Pringles are on sale this week for $1.99 each or three for $5 and my family loves sprinkles. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab four tubs, tubes, whatever you wanna call them, canisters <laughs> of the Pringles. Now, three of them rang up, three for five. The last one rang up at regular price, which I did not catch. Uh, so make sure that you're watching that. I've had that happen um, with these types of promotions before. And once again, we're gonna get a little double dip action. So I'm gonna use this $1 printable coupon off of four. And then I also have a digital coupon for $1 off of four that will double dip and come off. All right, so that's $29.97 in snacks and cereal. After all my coupons and CRTs, it'll bring me down to $10.97. I'll earn back a $2 extra buck for the Oreos. So it's gonna make my cost about 81 cents an item because I've got 11 items here, which I do not think is bad at all. All right, we are going to move on to do a big transaction. I wanna do the spend 30, earn 10 household deal. I was looking for the big packs of Charmin, but apparently my store is out. But that's okay because I'm super happy to pick up another big pack of the Bounty Paper Towel, the eight equals 12, which is on sale for $12.99. And then to add to the spend 30, earn 10, I'm gonna go ahead and grab two of the Liquid Tides, the $5.94. I was hoping my store may be restocked on the 46 ounce, but they did not, which is totally fine. I'm gonna go ahead and grab these two. And just in case you haven't done your shopping yet, be super careful to pay attention to these tags because I think there was an error in the dates and certain products are tagged. I don't know, I don't think it's this one. Let me find one right here, the gain. It's tagged for $4.94 with the dates of 9.12 to 9.25 and it says P&G and Lysol. That's last week's deal. These will not track for this week's deal even though they are tagged. If you bought them, hopefully your store honored it since the tags are clearly wrong, but beware of that. You can always look up the products online to see if they're actually included. So this little downy is not included in the spend 30 earn 10, but the bigger downy is. So I'm gonna grab the bigger downy for 594. So I now have $30.81 worth of product here. I'm gonna use a $1 coupon off of the Downy. I'm gonna use two $2 coupons off the Tide. We also have digitals available if your store will not allow you to use two. And then I have this $2 coupon off of the Bounty Paper Towel. Now I'm gonna be adding this in with a $10 off 70 on your next purchase CRT that I got last week. So we're gonna get our total quite a bit above 70 actually. I'm going for the Cetaphil deal. It spend 30, earned back $8 in extra bucks. And I was so happy to see that my store had plenty of stock of these Cetaphil wipes because we really love these. So these are $8.29 each. So I'm gonna grab four of these. So that totals me $33.61. I'm gonna go ahead and use the $6 off of two paper coupons that just came in our Sunday insert. I'm gonna use two of them since I'm buying four. I also have a CRT for $5 off when I buy two Cetaphil products. 
And I have a $3 off when you spend 15 on Cetaphil CRT that I'm going to use. And this deal is too good, so I am definitely adding this to my 10 off 70. The Joa Cosmetics are on promotion for spend 15, earn back a $10 extra buck. I have been using their setting powder and I really like it. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of these setting powders, which is priced at, I think it's $7.99, yeah, $7.99 for this. And let me know if you are a lip gloss girl or a lipstick girl. I typically am a lip gloss girl, so I'm gonna try out their lip gloss for $6.99. So these two products are gonna total me $14.98, I have no coupons for these other than my 10 off 70. And then the last thing we're gonna add into this scenario is some Tresemme. It's super easy. We're going for the two for 10 Tresemme. My store is like, they don't have conditioner in the kind they have shampoo. They don't have shampoo in the kind they have conditioner for. Uh, so I'm just gonna go ahead and grab two con not two conditioners, two shampoos, different kinds. Uh, they are on sale two for 10 and they are on promotion for if you buy two, you earn back a $2 extra buck. So I'm gonna use, we're gonna get some double dip action here. I'm gonna use my $4 off two paper coupon and we have a $4 off two digital coupon that will also double dip and come off. All right, so product total I have here is $89.10. Remember, I'm using a 10 off 70, so I have to spend 70. And then I'm using a three off 15 on Cetaphil, so I have to spend an additional $15 in Cetaphil products, which I spent over 33. So those two added up means I have to spend at least 85 to use both. So I'm at 89.10. After all my coupons and all my CRTs, it's gonna bring me down to $44.10 for this transaction here. I'll learn back. $10 for spending 30 on the household products, $10 for spending 15 on Joa, $8 for the Cetaphil, and $2 for the Tresemme. So it's gonna make my cost $14.10 for this almost $90 worth of product. So we need to go make some money to get that cost lower. So we are gonna do the epic beauty event deal of spend 30, earn back $10 in an extra buck or spend 45, earn back 15. I'm going for the 45. I'm grabbing some of this L'Oreal Elvive. And remember, this is our last week of this. So for the L'Oreal Elvive, I'm gonna use a $3 off paper coupon. And I also have a $3 off to digital coupon that will double dip and come off. And then we're gonna grab some Revlon products that are included in on this deal. And remember, this is also the last week where we're gonna be earning an extra 10% back in our beauty box. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab three of the Revlon Kiss, Revlon Kiss Balms, which are priced at $5.59 in my store. And then I'm gonna grab a Revlon um, Eyeliner, which is priced at $8.69. So total in Revlon products I have is $25.46. You can always search coupontom.com to find out what inserts any coupons come from. I'm gonna use one paper coupon for $3 off the eye, and then I'm gonna use three paper coupons for $3 off the lip. If your store won't allow you to use all three, we do have a digital available and there are printables available. And I also have a $5 off when I spend 25 on Revlon products and my $3 instant coupon from last week. All right, to finish out this deal, oh, I'm so excited. I'm grabbing some more of these adorable paparazzi products. These are included and they are on sale for buy two, get one free. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab three of these awesome, adorable bath poofs. I'm just gonna, I don't know, just mix up my colors. I'm so excited to stock up on these. These are super soft feeling and I just think they're so dang cute. So you can only count two of them towards your totals because one of them will ring up for free. And I have a $1 CRT off of Beauty, no, not Beauty 360, off of Paparazzi Bath Poofs. And then the very last thing, I'm gonna go for some more of the Paparazzi Hand Soap. 
I've been using this one. It smells pretty good, and I think they're dang adorable. So these are also buy two, get the third free, and included in on this epic beauty promotion. So again, you can only count the value of two of these. And I have a $1 CRT for the hand soap and a $2 off when I spend six on the hand soap. So I have a total here of $46.22, so I'm way over the $40 mark. After all my CRTs and coupons, it's going to bring me down to $16.22, and I will earn back a $15 extra buck. So it'll be a teeny little money maker after beauty tracking, but let's get to making some dang money. All right, we're going for the cover, girl. It is buy two, earn back a $6 extra buck. And I have some awesome CRTs for the cover girl blurring serum. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab this for $19.99. And then I'm gonna go ahead and grab, I got this yesterday. Um, they don't have the kind I bought yesterday. I'm going to go for one of the uh, eyeshadow palettes for $6.99. And I've showed this trick before, but because those coupons never seem to work on the eyeshadow palettes, I checked the barcode of this eyeshadow palette that I picked up. If it does not match the first few numbers of the barcode on the coupon, the coupon typically will beep and you can see these numbers do not match. So I'm not messing with it. I checked all of the eyeshadow, none of them matched. So I'm gonna go ahead and just go for a twin brow pencil. And I'm gonna use my $3 off eye coupon. And then for the serum, I'm gonna use this $3 off Clean Beauty. I hope this coupon matches this. Anyways, I have $26.48 in CoverGirl products. I'll use those two coupons. Then I have two $6 off CoverGirl Serum CRTs, and I have a $6 off when you spend 20 on CoverGirl CRT. That's gonna bring me all the way down to 248, and I will earn back $6 extra buck, making them free plus a 352 money maker. All right, we're gonna grab a little freebie on the Irish Spring. They are $3.99, and on promotion for if you buy two, you earn back a $3 extra buck. So I'm gonna grab these two, which will total me $7.98. I have a $1 digital coupon on the app, and I have this $1 paper coupon that I'm going to use. Then I also have a CRT for $3 off when I purchase two Irish Spring. That'll drop me down to uh, $2.98, and I'll earn back a $3 extra buck, making them totally free. All right, we're gonna repeat this deal that I did yesterday on the Axe Sprays. Several different products are included, but I'm going for the sprays. They are buy one, get one half price, and they are on promotion for buy two, earn back $2 in extra bucks. And these are priced at $6.29 in my store. So two is gonna total me $9.43. I'm gonna use these two $1.50 paper coupons. And then I also have a CRT for $3 off Axe. That'll bring me down to $3.43. I'll earn back a $2 extra buck. Then I'll submit to Ibotta for $3 back for purchasing two. And I'll submit to Fetch Rewards for $1 back. I only have one more offer left. So that will make my cost a free plus a $2.56 moneymaker. All right, next little moneymaker is gonna be on some oral care. Uh, the Oral-B toothbrushes and Select Crest are on sale for $3.99. And when you buy three, you earn back $5 in extra bucks. And this is a limit of two. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this two times. So I'm gonna grab three of the charcoal toothbrushes, two of the, whatever they're called, cross-action toothbrushes. And then I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of the $3.99 toothpaste. So these six products are gonna total me $23.94. I have a $5 off when I spend 20 on these products. I'm gonna use a $2 paper coupon off the toothpaste. I'm gonna use two $2 paper coupons off the toothbrush. Then I have three items left, which my five off three will attach to, and I have a $2 off one on the toothbrushes that will also double dip and come off. So that's gonna bring me down to a $5.94 and I will earn back $10 in extra bucks, making these free plus a $4.06 money maker. I thought I was all done, but then I checked my P.O. box yesterday. So we're gonna do the Maybelline deal, which is on promotion for buy two, earn back a $6 extra buck. 
very special thank you to Ayrton. I hope I'm saying your name right, Ayrton, for sending me some awesome coupons. I can't wait to show you. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab a mascara for $7.49. And then I'm gonna grab one of these packs of the Twin Brow Pencils for $4.99. So these two total me $9.43. I do have the $3 instant coupon we all got this week. And then look at these awesome coupons that Ayrton found in the store. Uh, my store doesn't ever have these, but $3 off each one of these Maybelline. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. It's gonna drop me down to $3.48 for these two, and I'll earn back a $6 extra buck, making these free plus a $2.52 moneymaker. All right, we got a lot of stuff. This is gonna complete my second CVS haul, so let's head to the kitchen table and go over our final cost. Oh my goodness. Here we are back at the kitchen table. Look at this haul. I'm so dang excited. Everything worked beautifully, except for I made one little mistake. Oh, I didn't even realize I made the mistake until I was editing the video. And I'm like, dang it, Jody. I was chatting with the cashier. I knew something. I knew I was missing something. I'll tell you about it when I get to that receipt. All right. So I did the food deal first all by itself. And here it is, so there's my Pringles. And you can see my fourth one did not ring up at the $1.99. I've had trouble with sales like this before, where it's a dollar on sale for $1.99 or three for five. The rest of them ring up three for five. Ah, uh, there's my 100 Grand Bars, my two Oreos, and my two Kellogg's. So I used um, the coupons off of the Pringles and the Kellogg's, my $2 off of the candy, there's my $1 off Pringles double dipping and come off. My $1 off Kellogg's double dipping and coming off. My five off 25 food. Both of my $2 off instant CRTs, one from last week, one from this week. I used $10 in extra bucks to pay, plus a little bit of my quarterly extra bucks. I, I had to pay 80 cents. I don't even get charged tax on food in Michigan. And I earned back my $2 extra buck for the Oreos cookies. All right, and then I moved on and I did my big uh, $10 off 70 transaction. And so here we go. I've got my Tresemme at two for 10, my Big Bounty, the Downy, the Tide, the Two Joa, and the Three Cetaphil. So I used all of those coupons that I already told you about in the store, my Tresemme, my Cetaphil, my Cetaphil. Uh, those are probably off the Tide, off the Downy, and off of the Bounty. My $4 off the Tresemme did double dip and come off. There's my 10 off 70, my 5 off 2 Cetaphil, my 3 off 15 Cetaphil, and then I used, um, $43 in extra bucks to pay. I had a subtotal of 95 cents on this transaction. I earned back my $2 extra buck for the Tresemme, my $8 extra buck for the Cetaphil, my $10 extra buck for the Joa, and my $10 extra buck for spending 30. And then I moved on and I did my epic beauty event. So excited I got the paparazzi items again. Added in the L'Oreal and the Revlon. And then on this receipt, I also have... Um, the CoverGirl and the Irish Spring I added in. So here's my Elvive two for eight, my two Irish Spring at $3.99 each, my Paparazzi buy two, get the third free, my Paparazzi buy two, get the third free. And then there's my Revlon items, my CoverGirl and my other CoverGirl. So I used all of those paper coupons on the Revlon, the two on the CoverGirl, um, my $3 off the two L5, my $1 off, I don't remember what, CoverGirl Revlon, oh, Irish Spring, <laughs> my $1 off the Irish Spring, and then I had four coupons off Revlon, two off of, so there's my other three. My $3 off the L'Oreal, double dipped and came off, there's my other $1 off the Irish Spring, my six off 20 CoverGirl came off. Both of my $6 off CoverGirl serums. Now I have had a lot of people tell me that they are having issues where two of the same CRT, for instance, my CoverGirl serum. I had a $6 from 
last week that I got and a six dollar from this week. You're telling me no matter what you do, both of them are not coming off. First of all, make sure the value is there because if the CRT has to lower itself down, it won't do it at self-checkout and the cashier does have to manually do that. But if this were the circumstance where I had enough value and two of them are not coming off, I'm wondering if your store's system has been updated and maybe we will all eventually see this happening. Just like there are a few stores where the double dip does not happen. I had one person tell me, that they upgraded one register only in that store. And on that one register, the double dip will not work, but it will work on all the rest of the registers. Really weird. So let me know if that's been happening to you. But I literally don't do anything special. They both just apply. Um, There's my 5 off 25 Revlon, my $3 off Revlon instant coupon from last week. My two off six on the paparazzi hand soap, my one off the hand soap, my one off the paparazzi bath. What you do not see in this transaction is my $3 off two on the Irish Spring. I was literally chatting with the cashier when I was checking out and I thought to myself, I don't think I sent something to my card. And I checked my cover girl because I thought, oh, I think it's the cover girl. I checked and made sure I sent all the CRTs to my card for cover girl and I did. Didn't even think about the Irish Spring. I flipping did not send it to my card. OMG. I used $22 in extra bucks. Had a subtotal of $268. Could not figure out why I had a subtotal of $268. Uh, yeah, because I forgot to send the three off too. Oh my gosh. Anyways, mistakes happen to all of us. I earned my $15 extra buck for the Epic Beauty event. I earned my $6 extra buck for the Cover Girl and my $3 extra buck for the Irish Spring. Such a bummer, I still can't believe I did that. Cause wait till you hear my totals, OMG. And then the last one I did the Oral-B, the Crest Toothpaste, which is just hiding back there. Um, and the Maybelline, I add, oh, and the Axe in this one. So here is my six Crest items, my two Axe items, and then my two Maybelline items used the $2 coupons, the three of them off the Crest and Oral-B items, my two one fifty off the Axe, my $3 off um, the Maybelline, two of them. Oh my gosh, are those not awesome coupons? Thank you so much again, Ariton, for sending me those. When I opened up that envelope, I was like, holy crap, where'd you get these coupons? Uh, there's my $2 digital coupon off one of the Oral-Bs and my five off three. And then my five off 20 on the Crest and Scope products came off. My $3 off the Axe. My $3 off the Maybelline. So I used um, $12 in extra bucks to pay for this. Had a subtotal of 85 cents. And then I earned back my $10 extra buck for the Crest because I did it twice. My $2 extra buck for the Axe. And then my $6 extra buck for the Maybelline. Oh my gosh. All right. So we grabbed sale price here, $241.85 in products. Wow. I love this haul. I used $87 in extra bucks to pay for this haul, plus had subtotals of $5.28. Oh, because I forgot that dang three off two CRT. So my cost was $92.28. I just showed you $74 in extra bucks that I earned back. Plus I spent $130.56 towards beauty. So within 48 hours, I will earn back another $12 in beauty bucks. So I earned $86. Then submitted to Ibotta for $3 back on the two acts. And submitted to Ibotta for, not Ibotta, submitted to Fetch Rewards for $1 back on the axe because that deal was a limit of three and I already had done two. So I earned a total of $90 from this haul that cost me $92.28. So my cost for $241 in products was $2.28, which I was super pleased with uh, because I got a whole bunch of stuff I wanted to get, including, I mean, just to pay $2.28 for that food, is awesome. 
Then when I realized I forgot to send the dang three off two Irish Spring CRT to my card, I realized I could have had a dang freebie haul here. Oh my gosh. <sighs> it is what it is. I love this haul. I'm super duper pleased with it. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much and feel free to drop any awesome deals you found at CVS down in the comments and I'm going to see you again soon. Bye.